Alright folks, this is David on David's Brain, and... Uh, yes, uh, welcome back to my Let's Play of Psychonauts for the PS2 on PS4. Please be sure to like, share, and subscribe, and join to my Patreon. Link in the description at the bottom. Alright, uh, so yes, last time we finally managed to get our way through Glorious Theater, and sorted out her bipolar disorder, and now it's time to deal with Fred's schizophrenia. Alright. Our, our first was a. Our first was a. on fire. We're all gonna burn. Uh, hold on, I. Uh, hold on. Uh, uh, we're getting a bit ahead of ours. Uh, yeah, Fred, we're getting a bit ahead of ourselves now, aren't we? Oh, my blood runs hot with passion for battle. Ah! Don't bother. They fireproofed this whole building. A lot of the old inmates used to be fire starters, you know. Oh. All right. Well, anyways, time to go ins uh, cr uh, go inside that noodle and see what's up. Sacre bleu! I have been hit. Now, bon voyage, Raz. All right. So let's see what Fred's damage is. And it really is Napoleon in there. Huh, so much for that stereotype. And they're stuck playing a board game. Mm. Oh, at least there's plenty of pigments in here. And, uh, let's see how many we have to- 243! Oh, good lord, kill me! Yeah, uh, uh, for those who aren't aware, Waterloo World is one of the three- uh, is one of four infamous levels in this game. Yeah, first two being, uh, let's see, the others being, uh, let's see, Be Less Dance Party, then Black Velvetopia, and the last level. But yeah, Waterloo World has 243 figments in there for me to collect. Good news is, uh, I don't have to do anything intricate like with Glorious Theater. Bad news is, I'm going to have to do a lot of out-of-the-box thinking. Oh boy. Oh, for a second, I was sorry, so I saw a snail. Yep. Alright, so, uh. How's the game going, Fred? Who's winning? Nobody's winning! Want to know who's losing? The Bonaparte family name! And Fred Sanity, don't Look, forget I that. forfeit, okay? You win. Napoleon Bonaparte wins again. Is that the real Napoleon Bonaparte? I mean, the imaginary real Napoleon Bonaparte? Uh, yeah, whatever. Yeah, I'm actually related to him. Can you believe it? Huh. Shut up! Stop telling people that shameful fact. I don't even want to be here. But when this sad excuse for a Bonaparte lost a simple game of war to a feeble-minded invalid, I just could not take it anymore. I was forced to take control, and I will stay in control until I beat the love of victory into this degenerate swan who dares to call himself a Bonaparte. No, oh, really, great, great, great grandpa Napoleon. I do love victory, like a ton. I love it so much. You can go now. I swear. No nope. move. Yeah, no, this guy's not going anywhere. Oh, yep. where'd that come from? Yeah, I swear that hat box hack was not there just a second ago. Who's winning now? What do you think? Oh well, yeah. Mm. Who's winning now? Well, you know, Fred, you could, you know, maybe if you actually did go and try to win, maybe your great-great-great-great-great-grandpa might actually take the hit and go away. Uh -uh. Uh, so they're both, uh, so, yeah, they're both fixated on the game. Let's see here. Hey! Oh. Hey, found this. 
Hey, you found my super valuable rare coin. Yeah. Can I have it? Knock yourself out. I got enough memories of my dumb ancestors hanging around. Ugh. All right, so yeah, it seems pretty simple here. In order to get rid of the uh, get rid of Napoleon, we just need to make sure Fred wins the shadow game. So, here we go. And oh boy, I have no idea where to start here. What's this? My lazy opponent is actually trying to win? He has sent in reinforcements. Well, well. Then let the game truly begin. Send in my best soldier. You, destroy that bridge for France! For France! Oh. I hate your stupid bridge. This is how much I hate you. Ha <laughs> <laughs> Suck on that bridge! Ah, yes. Now I shall go torment this poor peasant over here. <laughs> oh, man, now look. The bridge is broken and I can't move my pieces past it anymore. I quit. Napoleon, you win. Fred, you no, gotta work with me here. No, we don't forfeit. We're gonna beat you, Mr. Genetic Memory of Napoleon Bonaparte. Ha <laughs> I like your je ne sais quoi, your joie de vivre. Maybe you will teach my long-legged nincompoop a lesson, eh? <laughs> Hello. All right, for glory. Yeah, uh, Fred, maybe this whole self-defeating attitude is kind of what uh, what Napoleon's getting at it, trying to go and beat, uh, you know, you know, make it go and grow a spine. You know, that might help. Yep. I am not shocked, but you should know for future reference that small people do not enjoy being lifted up as if they were children. I am an emperor! I am king! And you are... blue. And a very, very silly chair. Let's see the priceless coin and... I need these means a trophy. Okay. Well, yeah, might as well just go and clear out some of the clutter. Actually, let's just go and solve the problem here. Ta da! That was easy. Stronghold stormed, game one. Oh, you have to storm the stronghold with your knight, you stupid fool. Of course. Oh, of course it's never that easy. Why would it be? All right, so first things first, go and save that villager from the... Uh. Word to the wise, give up while you can. Fred's gonna win. <laughs> <laughs> I can burn wood with my mind. Well, that would be how you say, uh, cheating. Oh, you, uh, you think we care? Yeah, let's see here. Keep getting that mix up. Hey, don't touch my pieces. That is cheating. Can you use any tactic to win. Man, this salt shaker is totally in the way. I'll bet the real Napoleon never had to worry about stuff like this. Not sure that did anything, but okay. Can't get a good grip. Hey, don't touch my pieces. That is cheating. Oh, fine. All right, well, let's go and uh, see how. Ah. Gameception, then. And yeah, now the true horror of this level begins. Hmm. Yeah, 
yeah, how am I gonna get to that pigment there? Oh, there we go. We'll never get our troops over that river while the bridge is out. We need to get a carpenter to fix it. All right. Need your now. What kind? How would you kill a really big walking snail with a cannon? Well, remember, you can tumble fast when you're using your mental focus. That should help you avoid the cannonballs. And when you get up close, punch them. And when they're all sealed up like a pill bug. Light the fuse on the head and see what happens when that cannon goes off inside their armor. Ooh, that's when good. When you're tired of that, pick them up with TK and throw them in the water. Snails can't swim. <laughs> ah, both sadistic. I like it. Very good. Uh, yeah, of course, there's Fr uh, then there's Fred's mega sen uh, bur the big burly sensors. Ah. Alright, let's see if there's any figments up here. Nope. Oh! No, oh, I did manage to get one, so yay me! hidden out on the outskirts of the board game, so got to keep an eye out for that one. Hi. Is this big soldier bugging you? Yes. Well, why don't you come out here and fight him? Hmm. What's the pay? Uh, freedom? Yeah, oh, don't forget it. Uh. Hi. Is this big soldier bugging you? Yes. All right, then, how's about this? Hi. Is this big soldier bugging you? Yes. Hi. Is this big soldier bugging you? Yes. Uh. Hi. Is this big soldier bugging you? Yes. Yep. All right, looks like I have to go and get the carpenter to go and uh, uh, repair the bridge, and somehow that'll lead to getting, uh, getting rid of uh, Bonaparte's knight. Uh oh. Thank you. 
There we go. That's much more. Uh, that's way more satisfying. Alright. Got it. Let's see, do I have the tag? Yes, I do. Oh, that's pleasant. Well, let's go and take a look around. There's gotta be at least like, uh, yeah, I know there's one pigment around here somewhere. Ah, I think that might be the pigment. Chickens, sheep, birds, a pixie. Uh, what is that? Oh, is that a dead soldier? Let's see more birds. Napoleon severed head. Uh, no idea what that is. Let's see bales of hay, child's. Uh, let's see little soldiers. Let's see the Napole Napoleon's teddy bear, I think. circling around the map, making sure that uh, there is no hidden pigments around here. And yeah, I can just get back up to the normal board just be uh, smacking around these uh, uh, these wine corks. Yeah, I'm probably gonna regret this, but I should probably help out those sensors. Not like I have a choice anyway.
Uh, more uh, sensors more prominently around here shows that Fred is uh, definitely doing a little bit better off of Gloria. Or at least, like, well, for the most part. Try to make sure I don't run accidentally run out of time, just like with uh, like back in Glorious Theater. Just time got a bit away from me. That's all. Good grip. All right, so nothing in there. Oh. 
Hey, look! A musket! I'll bet I can arm our troops with that. Ah. Alright, that's good. Oh, well, yeah, hopefully maybe this musket can uh, get that, uh, get that uh, farmer up and down. See a segment up there. Watch it. Oh, great. Now I gotta go back up there and Ow. fly all the way back. Ugh. Hate that part. in this level are nothing short of a nightmare. How uh, small they are and all the tricky platforming to get to them. Just, just wonderful. Just to save myself a bit of a headache. Out bullet shopping back in a few. Where can I even go? I mean, do you see a bullet shop? Or do you yeah. see like a giant farmer around here buying bullets? I don't. Sci power upgrader, sensory scramble. You can further cloud your enemy's minds and confusion last twice as long. Well, provided, of course, I can actually get myself a uh, confusion. Uh, uh, I actually get the confusion power, which, uh, yeah, just give it, uh, give it like a level or two. Ah. 
gotta get those two. There we go. Oh, I see a mental cobweb. Let's see, how many uh, tags do I have? Oh, I got all the tags. Perfect. All that's up to do is just track these little guys down. Let's see, 100 and, uh, 114 left to, oh, uh, no, wait, 100 and, uh, 116 left to go. Oh, uh, great. Yeah, this one's probably gonna take a bit of a while. And, uh, what the? Um, okay, so... We're outside. Oh. Is Fred just stuck in his... I mean, I know Fred's stuck inside of his own head, but... Oh, what are we? Where are we right now? So, yeah. It, it, Inception? Hello? Oh, wow. That hurts. Oh, the walls are coming down. Oh, God. The, oh, God. The barriers. Ah. Hello, I'm recruiting for the army of Fred Bonaparte, and... Go away! Fred Bonaparte has forgotten the people, and we have forgotten him! What? Fred loves the people. He was just telling me that some of his best friends are, um, the people. Yeah, people! He has really? abandoned us. He doesn't care if we live or die. Look, I'll tell you what. I'll talk to Fred. I'll talk to him. And I'll prove to you that he cares about the common man, and that the fight is not meaningless. I'll believe it when I hear it from him. <clears throat> Alright, yeah, getting a bit ahead of myself here. Restore the hopeless peasant's faith of Fred. Watch! Ow! Well, yeah, while I'm in the neighborhood, might as well go and see the carpenter. Uh, go get that bridge up. Yep. <laughs> Got it! Well, good news is I already got all the French mental cobwebs, so hey, that's something. Alright, Fred, you'll be back in the same world of no time. Hello in there. 
Any carpenters home? Mr. Carpenter! Go away, burglar. I'm not a burglar. I'm a recruiter for Fred Bonaparte's army. We're a little light in our corps of engineers, see? Listen, I know you're a burglar. I've been listening to your footsteps on my roof all night trying to break in. Why don't you just slide down the chimney? I got a nice fire going for you in here, Mr. Burglar. Okay, if I'm a burglar, then how can I be down here talking to you and up on the roof at the same time? Uh... Maybe you're a ventriloquist. Listen, yeah, I was about to say. If I go see what's up on your roof and take care of it, will you come out and help fight Napoleon? <laughs> Maybe. Good enough. All right, fine, sure. I'll find a way onto the carpenter's roof. All right, so how do I get up there? Board is just a literal war game. Yeah, strange game. Uh, yeah, strange game. And unfortunately, it looks like Fred's motto is the only winning move is not to play. But not good enough for Napoleon. so much trouble. It's a ladder. Oh, what about this guy here? Maybe he can help? Hey, we really need your help out here on the battlefield. Did you talk to Fred Bonaparte yet? Oh, yeah, that guy. Oh, yeah. That's what I was supposed to do. All right, fine. I'll go talk to him in a little bit. First, I gotta go and, uh, well, uh, get rid of the burglar. Save me a lot of time and trouble. Thank you. 
on, this is ridiculous. If only there was a way to get myself, uh, like, more of an updraft. Find a way to get to the top of that sign. Now I just need that bird. Ah, there we go. Now I feel like an idiot. And that's my day visit. Uh, feels like an idiot count for the day. All right, now that, uh, now to go and clear out the burglar. Come on. Oh, I see. Thank you. 
Oh, God. But that's what I get for being an idiot. Hold on. How many more uh, figments do I have to get again? Alright, let's see here. Uh... Uh, math's not my forte. Anyway. versus Crispin. Yeah, and, uh, from what we can tell here, Fred uh, was actually the orderly before, uh, yeah, before the entire asylum went, uh, went downhill, Fred was the orderly. Then one day, he saw a young Crispin white-headed solitary confinement and, well, decided to try and cheer him up with a board game to get him to open up. And, well, at first, things were going well, and uh, apparently, in Fred's mind, it worked a little too well. And, yeah, Crispin kept beating him, and, well, yeah, that kind of, well, we'll see where that pans out later. Okay, here I come. Oh, uh, for God's sake, you dummy. Just get out there and fix the dang bridge, all right, will you? Just show me where there's some wood to work on, and I'll go to town. Phrasing. All right, buddy, I'll show you some wood to go work on. Yeah, phrasing. bridge over there. How about you fly me over there? My How legs about... seem to be glued onto this base, which is kind of weird. <laughs> uh, well, you are uh, you are literally just a pawn in somebody else's game, so yeah, I can't blame you there. Oh, now who went and broke my beautiful bridge? Don't worry, darling. I'll get you fixed up good as new in no time. Man, I am good. Mm. Oh, yep. You definitely are. Alright, uh, fix the bridge, so... Hey, buddy, you wanna come out? Hi. Is this big soldier bugging you? Yes. Alright, you're useless then. Thanks for your help, buddy. Uh, you can go now, I guess. Good work on that bridge there. Yeah, 
I think I nailed that one. Uh -huh. <laughs> carpenter joke. Yeah. Uh, carpenter dad joke. Alright, let's see. Excuse me, Mr. Bonaparte, but how do you play this game? Uh, this game is so easy, even a child like you can play it. All my worthless descendant has to do is move a night piece into the center of my stronghold. <laughs> but his knight isn't even on the board. He's hiding out in that house. Well, maybe he's got a good reason. And knights are good at storming strongholds, but they are no good at field combat. So he'll also need a strong militia to fight my soldiers. But he has no militia! His people are hiding out in their houses, hopeless, hungry, and unarmed! Yeah, but... So you see, it is an easy game, but Fred has already lost it. In more not ways than one. Time. This time, we're going to win. No, we're not. Shut up, you. Fred, shut up. Thank you. Oh, for God's sake. Yeah, I can see why Napoleon's getting so pissed off of Fred here. The guy's a complete weenus. Alright, yeah, so we're getting close to calling it a day, but first things first. I uh, might as well take a look inside and see if there's any more... Oh, wow, yeah, Napoleon has really got this place locked down tight. Another vault. Alright, stay here, you. Mm, come on. Alright, there we go. Uh, and yep, uh, after uh, thoroughly be, uh, losing to Crispin, Fred's next opponent is Napoleon. And yeah, Crispin's wins just kept piling up. And, yeah, Fred completely and utterly lost it. He, yeah, uh, his treatment for Crispin worked a little too well. And, yeah, uh, Fred's, uh, and, yeah, since Fred's the descendant of Napoleon Bonaparte, he kept remembering, Oh, God, I'm supposed to be the descendant of Napoleon? I suck! And, apparently, his ancestral memory agreed, and, well... <laughs> So yeah, the pull. Uh, so yeah, Napoleon's genetic memory won't leave until Fred goes and saps out of it and gets his fighting spirit back. And yeah, just like with Jasper back at the theater, uh, Napoleon is a figment of Fred's uh, is a natural figment of Fred's mind, so the sensors can't do anything. Oh, good thing there's no knockback. 
damn it here. Phew. All right. Let's see. How many more figments do I have to... Ooh, not that many left. Let's see. Six. Only 49 left to go. All right, let's see. Recruit a peasant to win Napoleon's soldiers. Uh, uh, let's see. Uh, restore the hopeless peasant's faith that Fred. All right, let's just... Yeah, you know what? Let's call it a day here. All right, next up, we're going to go... Uh, next time, we're going to get through the rest of a Waterloo world. And hopefully, uh, have Fred res uh, restore his fighting spirit and get Napoleon to leave. So, till next time, this is David on David's Brain. See you when I see ya. Bye-bye.